chit chat time hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Parissa York and today in my video will just kind of be like a little chit chat I'm gonna be talking about being positive and staying motivated it's a new year it's 2017 so I feel like everyone is just trying to go after what they want in life so I love watching videos like this so hopefully this would be kind of one of those videos to help other people so yeah I'm just gonna get right into it <laughs> The first tip I have for definitely being positive and having a positive life is to surround yourself with positive people. People who are go-getters, people who won't bring you down, people who motivate you, and people who just honestly like, you can see in their life that they're just, they're so happy and you know, they're always talking about doing this and doing that. Because all that stuff, like those kind of people, is just gonna rub off on you. So when you're around positive people, then you're gonna be a positive person so definitely be careful who you surround yourself with the next tip i have is to eliminate self-doubt this was like one of my hardest things <laughs> like especially last year it was just it was a challenge for me so when i say eliminate self-doubt that's when you say like you can't do something definitely eliminate that word from your vocabulary because you can achieve anything you want to in life and don't ever limit yourself don't say you can't do something because 10 times out of 10 you can do it so whether it's in school or a new job that you want to get or you know starting a youtube channel don't say you can't do something i have like 31 subscribers and i'm telling myself like oh i can't do it blah 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 just you know just do it just do it you know you can do anything in this world who knows maybe one day I have a thousand subscribers like who knows <laughs> so the next tip I have is to wake up and re read a positive quote and to surround things around you with positive quotes so like your room and your bathroom that's what I have so it's a nice little tip tip and the reason why I say to surround everything around you with positive quotes and things like that and to wake up and read a positive quote is especially when you wake up because that's going to be the first thing you see so say there's a quote that says live your life to the fullest and keep a smile on your face say that's the quote that's what you're going to be thinking about all day like oh you know this bad situation happened at work but you know what it's okay let me just keep a smile on my face let me not let it affect my day so I have like all these like different positive quotes in my bathroom and in my room and it really helps me stay motivated and positive especially if I'm going through a tough situation or I have an exam coming up and it'll definitely just help you stay on track with what you want to achieve so definitely do that my next tip is to keep a journal I love 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 this tip because it definitely helps me especially for those people who have a hard time you know ex expressing how they feel to other people whether it's a friend or a family member like you can't do that like it's just very very hard for you have a journal you know whether you had a bad day just write about it kind of just vent and just write it all out because you're not holding it in inside when you hold something in inside it's gonna affect you later in life like down the road so when you kind of just write it out that's gonna help you just release all of it and just you know keep going my next tip is to have a planner dun, 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 dun. this is the key to my year I feel like this baby right here is going to help me a ton which it already has so the reason I say keep a planner is because say you do have goals say you do have you know a dream or whatever it is that you want to do when you have a planner you write everything in here so say you want to lose weight you can write in here Monday work out for an hour Tuesday work out for 30 minutes Wednesday work out for another 30 minutes you know that's just an example so when you have a goal you have to have a plan so that's why I'm saying to keep a planner so you can actually plan everything out whether it's a weekly goal a monthly goal a year goal have a planner because when you actually plan out for that goal the more chances you are that you're gonna achieve that goal you can't have a goal and not have a plan like that's 
you're it's not gonna work so definitely have a planner like the one I have I got from Tarjay so I'll just show you what it looks like it says like this month and it'll have like a weekly goal it says work goal personal goals health goals focus on financial goals and important dates so I love this planner it was only about 13 bucks if you want to check that out I'll just put it down in the description box I'm pretty sure they still have this I like recently got this so won't be too hard to find the next tip I have is to read more whether that's books that you just generally like or self-help books which is one of my favorites right now I am currently reading what on earth am I here for by Rick Warren so what this book is about is the purpose driven life and kind of just like finding your purpose on life it's kind of like a Christianity book so saying you know what's God's purpose for me and how to execute on that and to keep God first number one so it's a really good book and whether you also like reading self-help books like I can give you guys like recommendations on my favorite self-help books that are like motivational and those kind of books another one of my biggest tips is to listen to motivational speakers one of my favorite motivational speakers is Eric Thomas he is amazing so personally what I do now every morning I'll listen to a motivational speech and before I go to bed I'll listen to a motivational speech it's something that I just tried um, with the new year so I just kind of want to see like how much that's gonna impact me throughout the whole year and you know the differences that I see from this year and last year so I definitely say Eric Thomas is a great person to watch one of my favorite speeches by him is called how bad do you want it you know I just started this channel and I'm, I've always been saying I was gonna create a channel and I just like never did it so this year I was like you know what I'm just going to, I'm just gonna do it like this is just, I feel like this is going to be such a great year for everyone because everyone has all these goals all these dreams you know the thing is we can all win but the only way that you'll do it is if you just you gotta do it just do it like Nike says just do it <laughs> so don't be sitting here talking about oh I want to achieve this or oh, I want to do this if you're not making any plans to execute that then it's not gonna happen so make sure you go out there and get what you gotta get if you want to start a channel do it if you only have 15 subscribers who cares I have like 31 subscribers I don't care I'm gonna keep making videos as long as somebody's watching <laughs> um, and my last tip is to L O B E yourself <laughs> love yourself I think this is the most important tip out of all the tips that I just explained because when you love yourself when you love yourself none of that negative stuff matters nothing and it's gonna help you with self growth you're just gonna see you're gonna be shining in all aspects of your life at the work at, in your career field at school anything just love yourself because no matter what happens in life at the end of the day the only person that you have and that will be there for you is yourself so nurture yourself you know protect yourself feed yourself positive things and drink water <laughs> so and you know some of the things that you could do for you know for you to like feel good about yourself if you have to do your makeup or you have to put on a cute little outfit do that if that's gonna help you feel good about yourself and to love yourself more do what you gotta do life is too short to limit yourself to anything if you have a goal go out there and achieve that goal thank you so much for watching my name is Parisi York if you have any questions comments or concerns pretty sure you won't have a concern but go ahead and put that down in the comments if you do <laughs> please like my channel not like my channel please like and subscribe I don't have our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure.